Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Julia, if you're new here. Today, I just kind of wanted to show you guys a couple new summer pieces that I've collected over the past few weeks, kind of show you how I would style them. Um, and yeah, so if you're new, thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe and let's get into the video. Okay, the first piece I wanted to show you guys um, is this dress that I recently got from Princess Polly. It's a maxi sheer dress. Um, it kind of is reminds me of like a boucle fabric. Um, it's very sheer. It looks a lot more sheer on camera actually with this lighting. Um, but I really like it. Kind of has a nice big slit down the side. So okay, so here's just like a realistic way that I would style this outfit and feel comfortable in. Um, again, not that I don't like the sheer aspect of it, but it's just a lot of it's a lot of body, it's a lot of butt if you don't put a jacket over it. So just pairing it with this black blazer that I have and then these um, right below the knee tall boots. Again, it has that slit on the side, which I kind of like, so it kind of shows off the boots. I also think what's nice about this dress is that it's a good transitional piece. I mean, yes, it's sheer, it's like cream color, it's screaming summer, but at the same time, you could totally layer this for the fall like you can put a big sweater over this put a belt cinch it at the waist whatever you want to do um but i just definitely think that this is something that i could wear now and in a few months from now so that's why i liked it that's why i bought it okay the next two pieces i wanted to talk about one was this sheer black top keeping with the sheer theme um that i actually got from amazon i saw one um a very similar top to this that was like $200 um, and Amazon did its thing and so I got this it has like a little like scarf detail on it which I personally really like I think it looks like really flattering so I kind of just like wrapped it around a couple times so it wasn't dragging on the floor because I feel like sometimes these tops like there's too much fabric on it and I just don't like that look so I kind of wrapped it around my neck a little bit and gives a little bit more coverage as well. Tucked it in to this long cream denim skirt that I got from Princess Polly. So I really like this skirt. It looks a little bit whiter on camera, but it is a true cream, um, which I think is a really nice transitional color for fall. Um, I am not one of those people that doesn't like to wear white or cream in fall. So it's really, you know, it's just a matter of preference. But um, so this, I love i love a long denim skirt so i'm just pairing it again with those tall black boots and what i like about the skirt is does it have a, it does have a big slit in the back um not so much that you know you're gonna bend down and anything's gonna show or anything like that so again i love this look i put um this belt that i got i think i showed this in my last video i think i got this from amazon a long time ago um but what I like about this skirt a lot, this I like this big band right here. Um, I think that's just a cool little detail. It makes the skirt just look a little bit different than your typical denim skirt, which, you know, the belt would be right here in line with the zipper. So I thought that was just a little interesting. I want to say it's like 70s vibes. I feel like 70s has like been coming back. Um, and that's like my personal favorite style. Like if I could choose one era to live in for the style, it would be in the 70s. I also just wanted to show the versatility and in this skirt um, and you can also see how cream it is compared to me having a white tank top on now but like this like something like this with like Birkenstock slides um, those new slides that I actually got in my Revol haul would like go perfect with this outfit but like something like this you can just throw on and make it way more casual and I really like it um, I also really like kind of that monochromatic look um, in the sense that you know we're doing like white on beige white on cream I think that's a really beautiful look for this summer not to say if you really wanted to get like super monochromatic put a big oversized cream blazer and then do like maybe like brown boots I feel like that would look really cute with this um, or like a pop of color in the shoe or a pop of color like in a handbag or something like this but like you can really just like dress up this skirt i also wanted to note like just how good of a tank top this is um it should still be online on h and i didn't get it that long ago but um it's like stretchy i actually ended up cutting it at the bottom and i put it through the wash multiple times it hasn't frayed um it's just a really really good quality white tank top and that i think is like number one essential thing that i need in my wardrobe it's so versatile and you can really just like make so many different looks with it so i love this alone i love like the plain look but like 
I actually recently got this sweater from Princess Polly as well. <laughs> I shop there a lot because one, it's affordable and two, I feel like it's one of those sites that like really keeps up on trends. And I think I saw this online, like it's styled very similar, um, but I love this look. I, I feel like like the crochet vibes are really in right now. Um, and yeah, I really like this. I can see this, like, I can see myself like wearing this in the fall and also in summer. Um, I really love this sweater with a long white linen maxi skirt. That's what I have on now here. Um, I feel like you guys have probably seen me wear this in multiple videos. And I feel like when I find a good staple in my closet, I want to wear it again and again. That's for me point of buying clothes. I don't really like to just wear something once, so if I can get a lot of use out of it, I know it's worth the purchase. Um, so yeah, I put this little sweater and tank with this skirt. Again, I love this skirt. I feel like this is like the it piece for summer, and um, I have definitely bought into the trend, but again, I feel like you could put this with like brown cowboy boots, which I don't have. I want a pair, but um, or like you know, black, like maybe riding boots or something, sandals, sneakers, really whatever. I feel like it's like a versatile skirt and a versatile outfit. You can like dress this up. You can put your hair in like a slick back bun and kind of like make it a more elegant look. But yeah, I would definitely like put this together. I know this like seems really basic too, but I personally just think like something like this, um, this is something I would wear all the time. This is like a uniform for me, <laughs> honestly. Um, it's plain, but I really like it. Obviously I would like to take this bra off, but I also think a long maxi skirt, like nothing looks better than a tube top. Um, again, I'm kind of going with the monochromatic look. It's just a little sheer top that I got from H&M last summer. I'm sure they have something very similar online right now. I just wanted to show another way that you can kind of dress up this outfit, or at least how I would dress it up. Going back to this cream blazer I have here, I really like this look. I'd probably keep this with um, like a pair of like brown leather boots. Um, I have these on. This is how I would kind of dress this skirt up because I think by in general it's definitely more of a casual piece but i think putting like some sort of blazer some sort of structured uh piece on top um since this has like big structured shoulder pads um i think it kind of dresses up and elevates the look a little bit and same with having a toe or a boot quite like this okay so next up i wanted to just kind of show how i would style these jeans these are the girlfriend denim jeans that i got from revolve they are a true boyfriend fit um, you can tell they are like floor length to me and then I'm 5'8 and I'm a tall girl so these really work for me. Um, they're pretty loose in the butt. You're not going to really, <laughs> you're not showing off your curves in these but again I think something like this, this is like the most basic outfit ever but this is something that I would throw on and, and run out the door. Going back to that sheer top, um, I like putting like a sexier top or something that's tighter with something that's bag baggier. I think it balances it out well. Um, don't get me wrong, I will certainly wear these pants with like an oversized shirt or an oversized blazer or <laughs> a sweatshirt, but um, for like a going out type outfit, kind of balancing the bagginess element with something tighter always kind of makes it look makes it work. Um, and again, you can put this with like black boots. I just have these little black heels that I got from, once again, Princess Potley. Um, and yeah, and I feel like there's not a lot of color in this outfit, but I would really get creative like with like a pop of color like in your bag. Um, this is like a very basic outfit, but it's one of those ones that like you can't really go wrong with. To show um, another way that I would wear these jeans um, and kind of elevate the look in the most basic, simple way possible. Um, so I just paired it with this white uh, baby tee that I got from Abercrombie. But what I did was I changed my shoes to these tall um, leather brown boots that I got last winter. I love these. Um, I think they're great for summer, fall, winter, whatever. I also just put this um, brown leather by Far bag. It's like very similar. <laughs> material and color to the boots. I feel like this elevates the look. I mean, I feel like I would wear this like, shopping as well as going to dinner. And you know, if you wanted to like elevate this even more, you know, you can put like a big brown leather jacket over it. Yeah. 
I would do something like this. Now, this is more fall, but you get the idea. And I also feel like having like an exaggerated boot like this really just elevates the look, makes it a little bit more fancy um, for whatever reason than having just like a an open toe type of look. Back to this white tank again, another realistic outfit that I would wear. These are from H&M. These are just these cargo pants that I picked up. I really like them. I've been wearing them a lot. Again, they're versatile. They're like kind of like an elevated linen pant, if we're being honest. Um, yeah, I really like them. I probably wear this outfit alone with like maybe like a cool hat or like a bright colored purse or something. But then like, I also think that layering is not just for fall. Like I would put something like this. I got this top from Free People last year, um, but something like this to kind of elevate the look a little bit. I really feel like it's like beachy and summery. You throw this on with like slides, put like a hat on or something like that. And then you have like a like summery look. Last but not least, I wanted to show these shorts that I got from Free People. They are like a cargo short. I don't have anything like this in my closet. And I just thought these were so cute, so cool. I'm sure they're not everyone's cup of tea. This is in a size small and I actually need to get a smaller size. I'm actually like pinning it in the back right now um, to keep them up. <laughs> but this is like a way that I would style these. I would put like some tall white socks on like I have here, some sneakers, a little white cropped tank and then um, I probably throw over a denim jacket kind of like this oversized denim jackets would be a look but yeah I love these I don't really think they're much of a transitional piece and um but at the same time I just thought they were like really cool can't explain it but I really like them I gravitated towards them so I would wear them like with a jacket without a jacket um you know with sneakers just like this maybe like put a hat with it um or I would like do maybe like an oversized tee, like a white tee or something, and then like some slides. Keep it simple. This is definitely not something that I'm gonna like go out to dinner in, but if I'm like just walking around or running errands or whatever, this is something that I would wear. So yeah, guys, that is the video. Those are just a couple pieces that I've been grabbing. I kind of just wanted to show realistic ways that I would, would wear these outfits. I hope it's helpful um, in some regard. And again, if you made it here, thank you so much for watching me and supporting my channel. Um, please like and subscribe. Please comment below. Let me know if you like this, if you want to see more types of videos like this. Um, and I will see you guys in the next one. Mwah.